whenever we sell our fig trees at the farmer's market, people who move here from other parts of the of Canada are always just amazed that you can grow fig you could grow fig trees here. Yeah, it's it's been good fun that trying all of these different fig varieties. If you go to a nursery, you get anywhere in in the West Coast here, you'll probably only get the same two or three varieties offered in every single store. Uh, right now we're growing over 140 different varieties and a good amount of those varieties will do beautifully here. In Ontario, it was the Italians and the Portuguese who uh, couldn't do without their fig trees, and so they would plant them either in pots and bring into their into their garages in the winter time, or their basements in their in the winter time. And some me would even grow them outside and. Uh, bury them in the winter winter outside they would either bury them in a pit and cover them with soil or they'd build some kind of box around them and then next spring they would uh, set up the tree again and, and it would grow again for another season luckily here on the west coast the climate is so cushy that we can grow these outside and they do beautifully and this is an Italian honey fig, still ripening. It won't be ripe till middle of August outside here in this part of the world, but it's a delicious, sweet fig. This variety here is Desert King, and it's currently the, the best single variety of fig tree here on the, in the Pacific Northwest. Every August you'll get loads of delicious, sweet, figs. Uh, it's a green fig on the outside, a strawberry red inside. The figs are huge themselves. It's hardy. Uh, it's, that's a hard one to beat. Uh, one variety that we're working on that we suspect will end up being even more of a favorite here is the Ronde de Bordeaux fig. It's a dark purple fig and we'll show you that one next. Here's one of our most favorite fig varieties. This one's called Ronde de Bordeaux. A beautiful, delicious, rich purple, dark purple fig. Uh, this is going to be one of the best, if not the best, fig for the Pacific Northwest. What an amazing flavor. Not many people know about Ronde de Bordeaux here, but uh, that's an, definitely an up-and-coming fig. Hardy, productive, uh, doesn't get better than this. This fig variety is called LSU Gold, and this is the most amazing fig I've ever had in my life. What a flavor, what an amazing fig. Huge uh, gold fig, uh, but it does take a lot of heat probably wouldn't uh, do as well as some just in your backyard but if you have a greenhouse or a cold frame wow give it a try after we take these cuttings off of the off of these mother fig trees we'll pot them up into uh, a bunch to a, a pot we have bottom heat here that helps uh, helps everything root and uh, before long we start getting roots and top growth out of these figs, fig cuttings and uh, we'll separate them and put them one to a pot and uh, and the rest is just uh, history. The figs grow like crazy and uh, we ship them all over the country. Um, it's, it's good fun, fun. The fig pe people are so compassionate about figs that it's a good community uh, we we have friends all over the country all over north america now uh, from our interactions with the uh, with figs